A up and welcome to Callum's Corner. Or should I say, welcome to a Callum's Corner hamper. That's right, before you, you see a camper based on Callum Adams. All the products here are from Callum Adams' famous YouTube videos. Um, so I've made this hamper for my younger brother because me and him religiously watch uh, Callum's Corner. Uh, we find him to be a great guy, very funny, uh, and it, it's fun to follow him on his uh, YouTube journey. Um, so for, yeah, like I said, for his birthday I've made him this hamper. And as you can see, uh, if you're a Callum's Corner fan, uh, a lot of these products he has reviewed or tasted or commented about uh, in his videos. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through these one by one because I've actually uh, got a little description on each product which actually quotes from his video, uh, well, pretty much. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll kick things off with the one that's probably jumping out at you here, the Tic Tac, because as we all know, Callum doesn't like Tic Tacs. Uh, I don't know why. Um, so we've got a face of Callum being pretty angry here, uh, and on the back it says, Whatever people say, my head does not look like a sodding Tic Tac. Do me a favour and destroy these spasmoidal little things. Although these are popcorn flavoured, so I'm quite interested uh, to see what they taste like. Um, well, popcorn, I assume. Uh, and then next up we've got the Wagon Wheel, uh, which Callum reviewed in one of his snacking videos. So one of them, you've got a, a, a nice smiley face from Callum, because he likes the Wagon Wheels. Uh, and here you go. A forgotten snack, and much better than those healthy Belvita rubbish. It's just a shame they're a lot smaller than when I was younger. Um, which is absolutely true, even when I was younger, these were a lot bigger than what they are now. Um, next up we got the, the Walnut Whips. Um, so, Walnut Whip. There's only one way to eat these delightful snacks. Bite off the base, eat halfway down and scoop out the fondant with your tongue, uh, leaving you with a bite of everything. Perfect. Um, which is actually a really cool way to eat these. I haven't tried that yet, Callum, but I've bought two, so hopefully my brother will let me have one. But like the Wagon Whip, either. These are what old time? They used to be a lot bigger many years ago. Um, next up, got some Ferrero Roger. Uh, the ambassadors are really spoiling you here. Eat it in two halves, and if you get a bad hazelnut, you have a little wrapper to discreetly dispose of it. Top tip from Callum there. Top tip. Uh, next up, we've got the After 8. So the Ferrero Roger and After 8 were from Christmas time. Uh, Callum's recommendations. Uh, so after eight, a classy Christmas treat. Stick these in your mouth and push them to the roof of your mouth and use your tongue to lick away at it. Gorgeous. Another good tip there from Callum. Next up we've got the uh, Toffifi. So the world's most underrated confectionery. A golden cup full of goodness that just slides down your throat in one of the most enjoyable manners ever. Uh, possible, sorry. That's a Callum's Corner quote. Next up... Borders, milk chocolate gingers, Callum's favourite biscuits. Without doubt, the best biscuits you can get. A bit pricey, but dunk these in your tea about four times and everything comes together. Beautiful. And then we've got, uh, from one of his more recent videos, the Chili Con Carne, Schwartz, um, which Callum tried to have as part of his vegan diet, but... He was planning on having this as part of his vegan challenge, which I just said. Uh, turns out it may contain milk. It either does or it doesn't. Urgh. Yeah, very frustrating there. You can, uh, where is it? I can't see where it says it, but I'm sure it does. Probably says it there. Anyway. And then the final one, which I'm not going to get out, is uh, a carrier bag here, which contains two things of beans. Here are two cans of beans readily prepped in a carrier bag in case any slimy spasmoids come your way. So that's kind of wrapped around the bottom of the hamper, so I don't really want to take them out. But yeah, that's it, guys. That is a Callum's Corner hamper. What do you think? And would you like to receive this hamper? Um, I know I would, but hopefully I'm going to steal some of the snacks uh, from here anyway. But yeah, thank you very much for coming to, uh, I guess, my corner of the woods. And I hope that... Callum yourself, you get to see this because you've inspired all of this. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching guys, and I guess I'll see you again maybe one day. Bye bye.